just to show you a sample of um, draw to list possibilities is I'm going to convert a part of this drawing to code. I, I, I converted the whole thing to code but it ended up writing 29,956 lines of code and it took about uh, a minute and a half to write all the code for all these all these entities so we're just going to do the elevation and plan view on the left hand side we're going to do it as new auto without text entities and it's just created that into code or <coughs> excuse me converted it into code we're going to erase the previous it's going to format it right quick we're going to go to the very end and it uh, 3690 lines of code that's a little bit more manageable we're going to go ahead and load this and then we're going to type in sample code if I know how to type and it recreated every entity in here well what this means basically is I can use draw to list to just do this stringer for instance and another one uh, another program just to do the treads and another program just to do the railings and another program to do the kick plate on the railings and then you can mash them all together and make large programs uh, that's part of the power of draw to list you can con quickly convert it to base code take that base code and then create large uh, very complicated programs out of them. For more information, just contact Dan Fleming at dansmark.com. Thank you.